Finally, an affordable ball reviver from Pyramid Bowling. The Pyramid Phoenix is a device that heats your bowling ball at a safe temperature to remove dirt and oil that has been absorbed into the cover stock of your bowling balls. In this video, we will cover what you will receive in your box and how to set up and use your new Phoenix Ball Reviver. Let's review what's in the box of your new Phoenix Ball Reviver. So once you have unpacked your Pyramid Phoenix Ball Reviver, you will see one ventilated lid, a Pyramid Phoenix Owner's Manual, a Pyramid Ventilated Ball Cup, six cylinder pieces, these will be assembled to form the housing for the unit, and one base heating element with a 110 electrical cord. Now that we have everything unpacked, let's go through what we have, assembly, and how to use your new Phoenix Ball Reviver. You'll notice that the first level of the cylinder is pre-assembled and resting on top of the base heating unit. This can easily be removed and easily sets right back on top of the base. You will have to assemble the second level of the cylinder for the heating unit Inside, there are arrows indicating up and down. You will simply match those up and clip the tabs together. Let's get the rest of this assembled and then we'll move on. Now that we've got the second level of the cylinder assembled, you're going to simply rest it on top of the first level. The orientation of these tabs will not matter. They can be in any direction. They don't have to line up from the top to the bottom. You're then gonna place the ventilated ball cup Inside, setting it on the base, I'll show you, there is a raised section of the base and the ball cup will set right on top of that. Next, you're gonna go ahead and put a bowling ball inside. You're going to heat the bowling ball two times in one treatment. So we suggest that you do gripping holes facing up and then the second time gripping holes facing down, that'll ensure that you do the entire bowling ball. Next, we're gonna place the ventilated lid right on top of the cylinder, and we're going to press the on-off button one time. Once you turn on your Phoenix Ball Reviver, you'll notice that the digital screen will flash between two different numbers. The first is the temperature, which is 158 degrees. That is the max temperature the unit will get up to, which is a safe temperature to heat your bowling ball. The next number that'll flash on the screen is the time remaining. So the Pyramid Phoenix has an automatic shutoff and digital timer. It has been preset to 30 minutes. When that 30 minutes is up, the unit will shut off so you don't have to stand around and monitor the bowling ball. You can wait for it to shut off, flip the ball over, and repeat this step. While the unit is working, let's go over some of the differences that make the Phoenix superior. The Pyramid Phoenix heats your bowling ball from the bottom up to ensure proper extraction of the dirt and oil without allowing them to soak deeper into your bowling ball's cover stock. Our digital timer with automatic shutoff will let you know what temperature your unit is heating at and how much time is left. Unlike other units on the market, the Phoenix will automatically shut off after the preset time. This feature ensures that you will not overheat your bowling ball or leave it in the unit for too long. Our removable ventilated ball cup was uniquely designed to serve to allow heat to get to the entire surface of the bowling ball while it's in the unit. This ball cup is also removable and can be used as a regular ball cup for any other purpose. The Phoenix was designed to assemble quickly and easily break down for easier storage or transportation. And finally, like everything with Pyramid Bowling, the Phoenix was built by bowlers for bowlers. Our team worked on this for over a three year period to ensure that Pyramid was bringing a superior product to the market at an affordable price point. Once the 30 minute timer has elapsed, the unit will completely shut off. You can then remove the ventilated lid, take the bowling ball out, and flip it over to the other side. 
This time you'll do it with the gripping holes facing down. You'll replace the ventilated lid and hit the on off button one more time. Now it's important to note that due to the overall low amounts of oil that a ball absorbs in a normal amount of games, the reviver may not extract oil each and every time you use it. This is completely normal. Although oil may not appear on the surface of the bowling ball, rest assured that the Phoenix is working. Balls with higher amount of games on them with more oil in the cover stock will extract oil at a higher rate. Thank you for choosing Pyramid Bowling, and remember to always choose your path.